Hi, I'm Stu and this is day 115th of my backpacking adventure. Now, if you've been following me, you'll know that I'm in Kaikolka, which is a small Belize island. The island itself is about five miles long and at its widest, it's about just under a mile wide. It's about 20 miles away from the Belize mainland. But you've just caught me going down to the shops because my iPhone charger, the wire itself, has died to death and it's broken and I need a new one. A little bit worried about how much it's going to cost because Belize is very expensive. Um, but let's hope. So this is the store. Let's go in. So I've got myself a new charger and um, probably the cheapest thing I've bought in Belize so far. Thank God. $10 makes out for five pounds. So I can charge my phone. Woo woo. Now the biggest thing for this island is uh, tourism and fishing. And obviously tourism is massive mainly because it's got the second biggest coral reef in the world after Australia here. And funny enough, that's what I did a couple of days ago. And this is a video to show you what I saw. And it is amazing. Yeah, yeah. let's do it. You it can do this, Rebecca. Easy, easy. Yeah, man. Smile for the camera. Smile for the camera. A little lower. A little, a little closer right, right there. there. Smile for the camera. <laughs> <laughs>
So that is it from Kai Kolka. It's our last night and tomorrow we are leaving to go to the mainland and it's going to be uh, a wrench to leave this island because it is perfect. Um, the last thing I did before I came back tonight was to go to my favourite spot on the island which is the sunset spot and it's where they feed the stingrays every night. Basically they at four o'clock every evening someone goes in the water throws a load of fish down and stingrays come up and as you can see there are loads of them and you can stroke them and you can and i even fed one myself which i was quite impressed with so some top tips for kai kulka and the number one i can give you is stay here i never ever give any recommendation for hostels to stay in but this one's not even on any booking websites, hostelworld.com. They run by word of mouth. Travis Palm, I'll put a link in below uh, and for their Facebook page and I'll have their WhatsApp number and their email address. And the price for this place is 25 Belizean dollars a night uh, for a, an awesome dorm. Um, there's a rooftop area, fully fit kitchen it is just perfect and the cheapest on the island if not belize and if you are on a very tight budget like us do not eat out it's better off going to a supermarket get some food cooking upstairs and and, and living like a king for for example i went outside uh, for a panini and that was 14 belizean dollars which works out about seven pounds and that was just street food. So it's an expensive place, as I keep saying, but it's doable, it's worth it. Um, do a tour, see the island, feed the animals. It's awesome. But for now, it's time for me to go, get my head down. And if you like this video, you can just go, press the like button. If you want to see the next video, press subscribe. And any adventure that you know out there, Anybody that you know who wants to go backpacking, whether it be a younger guy, older woman, share this video with them, give them that little motivation that they need. But until next time, bye bye.